Hey guys, how's it going? It's Daniel here. Uh, today I'm going to be doing unboxing of the uh, Microsoft Wireless Mobile Mouse 3500 as you guys see here. Uh, this is in the blue model. It does come in variation of colors such as blue, pink, red, purple, and uh, this color here, the blue. I'm uh, pretty sure there's one more. I can't remember off the top of my head. Um, this is compatible with Windows 7. And I did purchase this mouse um, on Sunday for $16.99 plus tax. Um, if you live in Canada, you know Sunday, which was the 26th of December, is Boxing Day. So this is how I picked it up for like 20 or $30 less. This is probably 30 or $4 dollars uh, normal price. Um, so we'll go straight into it. We'll just look around the box for a second. Um, here's the mouse itself in blue. Here's the nano uh, transceiver. Um, it says comfort wherever you go. Uh, uh, blue track technology which I've read about um, basically on a standard mouse like this which is the wireless um, it has a red laser and uh, this one instead of a red it's blue and what that it does is the light has a wider range so when it's read when it's reading the data it has a it can collect the data better so it, this why pretty much apparently works on any surface better than a normal so, and I will talk about that in my review. I'll test different surfaces and maybe I'll even show you in a video. It's 2.4 gigahertz um, transceiver and all that. Its battery life is 8 months. That's incredible. And it's for this PC, Mac, and it's through USB to the side. Windows 7, Mac. Information on the bottom. The mouse. Here's the black. Here's some more data on English. Uh, I don't think it was focused. No. Well, whatever. Uh, let's move into the box. Um, I actually have previously opened this. I've been using it. Um, review will be soon. I'm sorry about. It. I couldn't open it on the Sunday. I just couldn't. My I actually was recording, but my camera battery died on me, and uh, I just I, don't know, I I really want to use my computer, and I really want to use this mouse. So I'm sorry about it. But I promise you, I I've basically put everything brand back into how it was placed when I opened it. And um, everything's still in pretty good mint condition. Uh, now let me tell you, when you open this, there's gonna be like a sticker here, 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 and here, like the tape thing. And uh, how you open it is, um, you just open this clip right here. It just opens up like this. When you open it, um, you can see there's two flaps just on the side. On the bottom here, there's one Duracell battery, which this is all it runs on. So, just close one flap, slide out. Slide all this information here. Uh, this is a start here guide. Actually, I've never even looked at any of these guys, so I'll try to kind of take a look here. What is this? I don't even know. Disposable waste of batteries. It's uh, cool. Here's the manual, probably. Sorry, guys, if I was just staring off the space, like, I, st I need to get a tripod because um, my angles just keep on going up. Nothing else in here. Just take the back. This plastic. Okay. Oh, there you see the mouse fall out. Here's the mouse. Looks really good. It's really uh, it's ergonomic. Get out the transceiver. There we go. There it is. Very small. As you guys know, uh, it's not on me. Uh, so let's actually take a look at the bottom of the mouse. Uh, so here's the advertisement for like the blue track. Here's a spot for the nano transceiver, the USB, and uh. Here's a compartment where the battery goes. And something nice about this, it has like a uh, sleeve that you can just pull out if you want to remove the battery. And uh, actually, I'll just show you right now. So the battery, it's one it runs on one double A. You just put it in like this. And if you want to remove it, you just kind of pull the tab. And it just kind of comes out. Well, you guys obviously want to keep it in, so we'll just do that. So put it back on. And then, if you want to put the uh, USB in here, you just put it in here, like that. And right above it is a button where you can just eject it like that. And then, one last button here, which I, I'm not sure if you can see well, but I'm just going to try is the on and off switch right there. So I'm just 
show you one here. That's the on and off. You guys, you see the blue light? And here's the button where uh, it shoots out the uh, tricks. I'll do that one more time in a different angle so you guys can see. That's it. Push the button. Uh, so yeah guys, um, this is going to be the end of the unboxing for the uh, Microsoft Wireless Mouse 3500. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. Uh, stay tuned for a review. You guys, please subscribe if you, this is your first time viewing the video. And if you enjoyed the video, uh, please thumbs up as well as if you enjoyed the video. If you didn't, uh, please thumbs down. Leave a comment in the description to how I can improve. I really want feedback guys because that's the only way. Sorry guys, a little bit. Uh, these videos can improve for you guys. Because uh, these guys, these videos are for your enjoyment and I want to know how to make it the best possible video. So yeah guys, uh, thanks for watching and I'll uh, see you later.